So, leg seven of the Moors Millions next, and this is a four mile one furlong version this time. Still 0 to 130, and the top one is Fearless Amy for Ryan Tamasebi. Enemy Flight, Darren Thompson, Moonsell Tavern, David Robertson, Victory Heights, David Hooley, Dictate Ross, Martin Leadham, Ingerbird, Darren Thompson, Compact Bonnie, James Shea, Silver, David Hooley, Safinaz Josie for David Robertson, Charlie 2, Thomas Rogers, Da Vinci, Paul Rhodes, Sang Blur, Craig Beckwith, Superior Ninja, Derek Hinton, Yahoo, John Morgan, No More Heaven, Paul Rhodes, Catching over Hassel, Thomas Rogers, Sonic to Dream, James Shea, Blue Penny, Martin Lidham, the Bansherman, Alex Cherry, Last Suspect, Graham Clutterbuck, End or Beginning, Craig Beckwith, Elevated Splore for Craig Allen, Linker Souls and Graham Clutterbuck, and Pampalone Flagship, Alex Cherry, 24 then this time, and I think we'd have probably had a few more if the racing had been a bit lower than 130 as well, because this is the only four mile plus race this week, I think, and they've been called in, and away they go. Uh, one of those John Morgan front runners, Yahoo, looks like it's going to show in the lead. Uh, Yahoo, the real Yahoo, was racing in the 80s. It was before most people had ever heard of the Yahoo, the email place. Uh, Yahoo, it is in front then. Used to run in the yellow coloured silks, was in the uh, gold cup when Desert Orchid won, and all those good gold cups in the 80s. Anyway, Yahoo's in the lead. Enemy flight second. End or begin in his third. The grey dictate Ross on the inside is just about fourth. And then catching over Hassel and Fearless Amy and Sonic to Dream as they sort themselves out. Big, big field for this. And that's what we like to see in these big long distance chases. A good big field. And as they all get over it, slow jump at the back from Linker Solzen. And hopefully next year we'll get a few more people in for the jump side of it. The jump side's really struggled this year, I think, with numbers. Flat's been okay, but the jumps definitely down and we could do we get in a few more big fields like this in some of the longer distance races but it's Yahoo's in the lead with enemy flight in second and end or beginning third then fearless Amy is fourth catching over Hassel is fifth the grey dictate Ross is on the inside in sixth superior ninja in a pink jacket from Derek Hinton is close up as well as they get over the next and that's number two of the 21 so 19 more still to take then and they are very well strung out already. Yahoo is set at a pretty stiff pace. He'll do well to keep this up for four miles and a furlong. He's already four clear. And as we've seen with John Morgan's horses already this season, they're pretty good when they stay on their feet. But they've got a tendency to miss one out as the purple jacketed horse there did. That was Victory Heights, I think, that made that pretty serious looking mistake. But it's Yahoo who's clear in the lead. Enemy flight is second. Catching over Hassel in the green jacket is third. The purple of Fearless Amy on the outside. Well, quite on the outside, just on the inside of um, End or Beginning as they take that next one. And this distant shot to try and keep them all in in the, in the picture is uh, making them look even more strong out than normal. And catching over Hassel was a faller there. So catching over Hassel has gone. This is like watching horse racing on a TV in the 70s where they only had a camera on the grandstand and they used to zoom in on the back straight and they were tiny little dots going along the back. You'd see, it was all in black and white as well. You'd see horses fall and you don't have a clue who it was. The commentator would be sort of struggling as well through his binoculars. But anyways, Yahoo in the lead as we go through all our yesterdays. Yahoo's in the lead then. Enemy flight is second. I should worry about this folks because this is only race two of the day and I'm in waffle mode already um, and you've got me all day as well so anyway it's Yahoo in the lead from Enemy Flight in second Dictate Ross is third End All Beginning is fourth and then Fearless Amy is fifth Superior and Ninja is next then Sonic to Dream and Blue Penny getting a bit closer then Moon Sail Savon and Compact Bonnie Silvers after that one Victory Heights is next as they take number seven and one or two mistakes again there David Robertson one of his horses made a bit of a mistake I think it was Moon Sail Tavern Safin has Josie, the other one seems to be going well enough on the inside as they take number eight. And again, they all stream over that one. Well, two of them a little bit messy, but there's a big, big gap from first to last, isn't there? And Yahoo, he's almost half a furlong in front of the back marker. Pampalone flagship, it's probably not quite that far, but it certainly does seem an awful long way, especially when we're panned out this much but it's Yahoo in the lead then from enemy flight second and now we're going to look at them racing away from us and they're going to be even smaller <laughs> you can see them come through to the next then and stream over this and they're all safely over that one as well and Yahoo's in front enemy flight second then all beginning third dictate Ross the grey going well in fourth fearless Amy in fifth and a bit of a gap of a length or two to the 
reminder as they get over the dam there's a faller there something's gone again I can't see who it is because we're too far away it's last suspect I can tell now the jockey and the horse embedded in the fence but it's Yahoo in the lead from this strange angle where they're racing away from us and now the leader's out of the shot now it's Yahoo in the lead enemy flight second end all beginning third then dictate Ross and fearless Amy and then superior ninja and sonic to dream and victory heights and then silver and then cold back bonnie and Blue Penny and Safinaz Josie and then Sangbler and Moosehell Tavern, Charlie 2, Deban Shaman, Inga Bird, No More Heaven, Elevated Splore, Da Vinci, Linka Souls and Pampalone Flagship, so at least we've got all the names in at least once then as we get over that one, and that will probably be the last on the next circuit, I would think. And Yahoo has led all the way so far, and is a good three lengths clear of enemy flight and end or beginning. Now we're going to get a look at them from the stand as we're whizzing around all over the place camera angles wise and Yahoo's in front from enemy flight second end all beginning third and then fearless Amy's fourth dictate Ross is fifth and then superior ninja sonic to dream victory heights compact bonnies after that blue penny trying to get a little bit closer as they take the 12th and they're all over that one as well with Pampalone flagship just a back marker so Yahoo's been in the lead all the way then leading by a good two and a half lengths to enemy flight in second fearless Amy is in third and end all beginning his fourth dictate Ross he's after that one as they get over the next and a mistake towards the back there was by Inga Bird and that one's shuffled back a few places gone behind um, elevated splore but it's Yahoo in front Yahoo is in the lead as they get over number 14 so Yahoo leads in enemy flight is about three lengths back in second then comes fearless Amy dictate Ross still going well in fourth then comes in all beginning and superior ninja then sonic to dream of victory heights compact Bonnie is after that one and then we're over the 15th this is another ditch and there's another fall there sonic to dream has gone this time so sonic to dream the latest one to depart the race and it's Yahoo in front from enemy flight in second then Fearless Amy and Dictate Ross together. Then comes Endor Beginning and Superior Ninja. After that one was Victory Heights. Then comes uh, Compact Bonnie and Silvers after that one. And Charlie 2. But it's Yahoo who's been in the lead pretty much all the way so far with just a little bit more than a mile to go and clear in front popping over that 16th with a clear lead from in second place enemy flight then dictate Ross has now moved into third fearless Amy is fourth end or beginning superior ninja and victory heights these are a couple of lengths clear of combat Bonnie in turn is clear of debancha man and silver and the rest of the chasing pack but they've got to get to this yahoo who's going well in the lead stood off that one but got over it really well been beginning to make a move in third is Fearless Amy, but it's Yahoo in front. Yahoo from enemy flight second. Fearless Amy third. Then end all beginning. Dictate Ross and Victory Heights and Superior Ninja as they take the 18th and over that one they go. And it's still Yahoo going really well in the lead. Yahoo still two lengths clear. Then from in second place, enemy flight. Fearless Amy is now a clear third. Dictate Ross is just beginning to struggle a little bit. Superior Ninja Jockey drives it up a cul de sac there. He's now stuck right behind Fearless Amy. I'm not sure what he's trying to do. The jockey on that Derek Hinton. And horse, but it's Yahoo's in the lead as we get an aerial shot even further away now. What is this cameraman doing? It's Yahoo in the lead. Then Yahoo comes to the 19th and gets over it in the lead. Yahoo from enemy flight. Fearless Amy's back in third. Superior Ninja then dictate Ross and get another camera angle change. It's Yahoo in the lead. Yahoo is six lengths clear. Racing down towards the second last. Yahoo is well clear of the chasing pack. He gets over the final ditch. He's clear of the second place horse. Enemy flight. Compact Bonnie and then Fearless Amy. But it's Yahoo's got one to jump and three furlongs to go. Here comes Elevated Splore now coming with a run on the outside. Not got to mention before. Compact Body is next. Yahoo is still in front. Two lengths clear. Yahoo, two lengths clear with one more fence to take. With Elevated Splore in second. Moonsal Tavern's gone up the back of the field. And Compact Bonnie's running on. Debancha Man's come through from nowhere. Dictate Ross is trying to run on again. But it's Yahoo in the lead. From Compact Bonnie in second. Debancha Man looks a big danger on the outside. But didn't jump that one too well at all. It's Yahoo in the lead. Compact Bonnie's beginning to corner. And this could be heartbreak for Yahoo. It's Compact Bonnie who takes it up. Yahoo's in second. Here comes Debancha Man. Elevated Splore and Dictate Ross. But it's Compact Bonnie who looks like she's going to take it. 
compact body from Yahoo and Debanshaman and it's compact body at the line it's actually compact body wins it Debanshaman in second Yahoo third then elevated explore and dictate Ross and Sang blur after that one and the third will trail all the way back to Da Vinci it was the last one to finish but a potentially exciting race there that got a little bit messy with the view and compact body takes it the Banshaman second, Yahoo third, Elevated Splore fourth. Let's take a look at the connections. It's another one for James Shea. Compact Bonnie, the winner for James Shea. The Banshaman for Alex Cherry second, Yahoo for John Morgan third, Elevated Splore for Craig Allen fourth, and Dictate Ross was fifth. <laughs>